，志愿军空军现辖刚组建的有两个歼击航空兵师、一个轰炸集团和一个强击集团，共有各型作战飞机不足两百架。飞机可以买，更重要的是飞行员。我们的飞行员都来自于东北老航校，平均飞行时间仅有一百多个小时，喷气式歼击机更是刚刚开始接触。没有任何空战实战的经验，跟美军飞行员比，差距还不小啊。美军的飞行员的飞行时间至少十倍于我们，其中很多都参加了第二次世界大战，具有丰富的空战经验。其中美军头号王牌飞行员戴维斯，号称二战中击落了上百架德国战机。要知己知彼，我对志愿军空军提出十二字方针：积蓄力量，选择时机。集中使用，是，在实战中锻炼，在战斗中成长，是。我们空军第四师第十团二十八大队已于前日抵达安东基地，在苏联空军的带领下进行了实战训练，以获取实战经验。我历来强调，不打无准备、无把握之仗。要打好第一战，建立起战胜美国空军的信心，这很重要啊。是。请主席放心，我们一定选择好时机。第一站，我必在现场指挥。刘震同志今天就赶赴安东，和二十八大队一起进行飞行训练。很好，这次战役就不赶趟了。希望用不了多久，我们的战鹰就能够一飞冲天，大显身手啊！是。我们上天两架飞机为一个小组，长机负责攻击发号施令，僚机。负责观察诱敌，明白吗？明白。你们今天的训练还是满分，尽责吧。教官，天天训练满分有什么用？我们申请上天和你们一起作战。不要着急，积累经验。你每次都这么说，你们到底什么时候可以带我们实战？我们能当僚机，保证完成任务。说实话，我们都是。参加过二战的老飞行员，飞行时间都超过了一千多小时。我们就没有人会把新手当作飞行员。你需要学习飞行、战斗，最终成长。教官，我们不用你们带了，我们自己组队上天参加战斗。祝你好运，美国人比你想象的要厉害。to clean up the, the defeat. I came here to be the commander of the 8th Army, succeeding General Walker, who passed away. I assure you, the UN command is not defeated in Korea. I came here to win this war. Uh, General, uh, Chinese Communist Party did not accept the 38 parallel uh, armistice proposed by uh, 13 Asian countries. Uh, what's your comment about that? As a soldier, I fight. I don't provide political opinions. Uh, General, uh, what, what, excuse me, one more question. Thank you. Uh, from a military point of view. Yes. Uh, when do you reckon the enemy will uh, launch an attack on 38 parallel? They just finished the last offensive. I don't think they're going to launch a new one soon. My estimate is they would need to rest for two to three months if they haste an attack. My army will hold the 38th parallel. We'll use the Yumjin River as a natural defense. Uh, General, why do you think our army was defeated? Was it because of our power and strength? Anyone with common sense knows that we have far more power and strength than the enemy. The problem is our troops' morale. I'll find a way to revive this morale and get back the feeling of victory. This is why you hang this grenade up on your chest, to boost the morale of the soldiers. This one is not for the others, but myself. As a soldier, I'm ready to die with my enemy, if I must. Oh, General, one more question. One more question. General, one more. Please, one more question. General.
General Ridgway, I never expected that you come directly to the front as soon as you got off the plane. I want to see the deployment of the Chinese Communist Army. There are about 200,000 Chinese Communist soldiers right across from us. And? That's all, General. What about their main defensive positions? And their movements? We don't know. The Chinese Communist troops are hiding themselves very well. It's hard to find out about their movements. We don't know much about them. Are there any enemy activities? Here in the hills, villages, rivers, along the 38th parallel? <sighs> Seemingly not. Seemingly not? Mm. Not knowing? Is this how you want to win battles for us? Do you hear yourself? I've read every report from every division here on my way over. You all complain that the Chinese Communist Army is keen in penetration attacks. That's because you rely too much on public roads. Instead of going higher into the hills and taking the higher ground. Understand? You complain about not having enough soldiers to create a strong front line, right? It's because every division works in its own way. There's no coordination, no mutual support, not even fire support. You all complain that the enemy likes to fight at night, right? It's because you didn't analyze the terrain and find ways to counterattack. I'm gonna be very clear with you. The Chinese Communist Army, they attack us any time now. If I hear any one of you shirking responsibilities, I'll have him court-martialed. I don't want to see any of my soldiers again with shoes untied. Go! Yes, sir! Yes, sir! You two guys are not small. The Chinese army is a three-year-old. When he was 18 years old, he was a young man. He was still his leader. After the war, he was recognized as 每八十二师师长，随后这个师就被改编为空降师，可以说是美陆军的精锐部队。率部从西西里岛开始作战，转战于欧洲的各个战场，参加了诺曼底的登陆作战，指挥部队、空降敌后，直接加速了德国海岸防线的崩溃，也为大规模的空降战术。开了个先例，嗯，还有吗？我觉得有几个方面要值得我们高度重视。就此人的作战经历和特点来说，战术上大开大合，敢想敢做，战术机敏，强调进攻性。所以我们一定要防范在美军的防御阶段会发起突然的反攻。虽然说空降登陆这一招。面对我们强大后方的支持，他不会轻举妄为。但是，利用空中力量切断我方后勤补给线，不应该是他的首选。我最担心的就是这个。无论如何，也要抢在这个叫叫什么？李奇微，李奇微的前面，不能让他呢有组织防御，甚至发动反攻的机会。及时发起第三次战役，获得战场上的主动权。Matt? What is it, Collier? Matt, I have to be frank. The morale of our boys is at the lowest. If the Chinese Communist Army launches an assault, I don't think we could keep the 38th parallel. Why are you so pessimistic? Their soldiers 
are humans after all. They cannot keep continuously attacking non-stop. It's not possible. And if they dare to do it, we just need to resist their first wave. And then we can find a way to destroy them. I hope that would happen. But what if we have to retreat? Then we have to fight and defend Seoul to the last. I know what I'm doing. I'm not interested in a city. I'm interested in winning the war.这个李希威还说过这样的话：一个士兵的死跟一个将军的死，在上帝眼里都是一样的，都是伟大生命的结束。每一个指挥官都必须牢记这个事实。他这一理念一旦被贯彻，我担心美军士兵的战斗意志力
严密监视。阵地前的地雷已经被炸没了，但江边还有一个雷场，你在扫雷组上，把他们清除干净。十分钟后，主力部队要开始冲锋，你要保证没有一颗地雷。是，保证完成任务。同志们，跟我来。
南下阵地了，命令后续部队和运输队快速跟进。是。Call in the air support. Tell the South Korean troops to hang in there. Our reinforcements should be there within two hours. Order the 25th Division to deploy to the Imjin River as soon as possible. It's urgent. Yes, sir. General, just lost engine. Hold on. The battle just started. It's true. We just got a report. The Chinese Communist Army got in there, bombed all over the place, and within 10 minutes broke through the defense line. The South Korean Army is collapsing. Are we still sending our troops? To do what? Get killed? Tell all there. the units to guard their positions and stay alert. I'll go to the front line myself. And from now on, I don't care what happens. I want to report on the situation every 10 minutes. Get my jeep ready. I will go now. Yes, sir. Wu Xinquan, you are the one who is going to be the one who is going to be the one who is going to 幺幺六师这十分钟不到，突破了对岸的防线，这叫什么？这就叫摧枯拉朽啊！幺幺六师，不愧是三盟之师啊！啊，给我接前线，韩先楚。喂，老韩，嘿嘿，首战告捷，打得好啊！告诉各军的战士们，呃，要不顾一切困难。不畏一切风险，不惜一切代价，给我勇猛的向南前进，立出最大限度，全力歼灭溃逃的敌人啊！好，我相信，哎，成功，彭总，哎，我军现在在临津江中心突破，追歼南朝鲜军没有问题。可如果这样深插猛打，很快就会和美军的迎头碰上。咱们的后勤保障有没有实力？这得感谢我们洪学智大管家，让我们后勤还能坚持三天。<笑>南朝鲜军扼守的第一道防线，这已经崩溃了。汉城正面吃紧，东线上呢？美军和英军的侧翼已经暴露出来了，现在我们就得看这个李奇微是怎么选择了。如果他选择不撤退，那他就面临着陷入我军穿插包围的这个结果。遭遇嘛，那跟头两次战役一样，只有惨。彭总，我军现在实力不足，即使包围了美军，也不见啃得动啊。如果……李奇微选择死守汉城，那么我们攻坚起来，会有很大的牺牲了。两军相逢，勇者胜。我敢打赌，这个李奇微新来乍到，他绝不敢拿美军的全部家当来跟我一搏。嗯，再说了，就算他不撤退，那我也不一定非要死攻汉城啊，我占不了汉城。我不战呢，我们的任务就是打过三八线，见势不妙，我随时都可以撤回来的。从现在来看，实现这个目标还难吗，同志们？啊？哎呀，让炊事班开饭吧，我这个我饿了，同志们呐！哎呀 ，Stop running away! Your soldiers! Go back and fight! Go back! 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 Tell the military police. They should block the road to stop all fleeing soldiers, give them guns and clothes, and make sure we get things under control. And if anyone disobeys, he will be punished under military law. Yes, sir. Contact the Air Force. Order the 5th Air Fleet to start bombing as hard as they can 
to stop the Chinese Communist Army from moving south on the road from Kaesong to Seoul. Let's try to delay the enemy for as long as possible. Yes, sir. Now I understand how Walker must have felt. We have such a shortage of men that we have to rely on the South Korean troops. But if they keep fleeing like this, our guys are completely exposed. Let's go back to Seoul. So we're not going to the front? It's pointless now. Forget about them. We have to take care of our soldiers and their safety. Go!黄总,黄总 好啊好啊<笑> 哎,闪电一样的突破 <笑>睡两个小时 <笑>我们的第三战已旗开得胜 是啊。我看这样是刚叫李叔叔去喊你们来
哎，爸爸，嗯、啊，我是你的女儿，我想改姓毛，行吗？怎么想起来跟爸爸姓了？叔叔们都在笑我，说我不姓毛就不是毛主席的女儿。<笑>不管是姓李还是姓毛，反正都是爸爸的女儿。哎，到底娇娇大几岁啊？啊，懂事。爸爸，嗯、啊，我给你背《阿房宫赋》。嗯，准确的念法。叫阿房宫赋。亚英哥哥五六岁的时候，就能背《百家姓》《三字经》了。那么难，你知道它是什么意思吗？啊，没关系啊，学习啊，往往就是从熟读开始。我起个头。六王毕，四海一，蜀山屋。阿房出。负压三百余里，隔离天日。啊，子龙叔叔，你是不是找我爸爸有事情啊？啊，是的，叔叔找爸爸有事情。好啊，你们先出去玩，啊，爸爸有公务要处理。晚上一块吃饭啊，我们听娇娇接着背《阿房宫赋》。好，那我背《百家姓》。好啊。<笑>看你这样子，是不是朝鲜战场出问题了？哦不，前线大捷，前线大捷。哈哈，志愿军好样的，说跨过三八线就跨过三八线。哈哈，第三次战役赢定了，叶子龙啊，这是大好事啊，干嘛耷拉个脸啊？主席，哎，这是彭老总给您的电报，还有周总理给您的信主席，您就哭着来吧，要不憋在心里头难受。战争嘛，总有伤亡。谁让他是我毛泽东的儿子呢？主席。司机知道了吗？拿到电报，就赶紧来了。林乔也看到了。先不要对思琪讲，刚结婚呢、啊，一下子他受不了啊！我知道，我知道。子龙啊，你先出去吧。我想一个人待一会儿
主席，毛岸英同志的牺牲是光荣的。当时，我因你在感冒中，未将此典送阅，但已送少奇同志阅过。在此事发生前后，我曾连电致司党委及彭，请他们严重注意指挥机关安全问题。前方回来的人未提及此事，高瑞新亦是一个很好的机要参谋。胜利之后，当在大榆洞及其他许多战场，多立些中国人民志愿军的烈士墓碑。周恩来。现在到哪儿了？韩福司令的右翼纵队已经到了从汶山、黄发里、湘水里、新义里一带，敌人的右翼彻底暴露。吴瑞林的左翼也已经到了中板里、嘉平和春川一带。南朝鲜军基本上还是望风而逃。哎，你们说说，一起为这家伙下一步。他会怎么样啊？李奇微要想守住汉城，他只有在汉城以北固守清平川、义政府和高阳一带，与我们打阻击战。现在啊，跟头两次战役很像，要命令前面的部队继续勇猛穿插，对汉城形成一个大的包围圈。这次。就是要包他一个大饺子。嗯，这馅儿，就是汉城美军的十万主力。<笑>对，拿下汉城，这不仅是军事上的重大胜利，在政治上，那也是有特殊意义的。洪总，嗯，李奇微会不会放弃汉城？<笑>有什么想法？汉城聚集了美国主力部队。和指挥机构，而且在汉江以北，如果他们撤退不及时，很可能会被我军前后夹击，这对他们非常不利。可如果他们撤到了汉江以南至三十七度线的狭窄地带，就可以有效地建立起强大的防线。嗯，从军事上来说嘛，你这么分析。这都没有错，但是呢，汉城的得失，它毕竟涉及到国际的政治影响啊。我们能够为了政治影响，不惜冒险，打过三八线去，那么敌人是不是也可能为了政治影响，他死守汉城啊？嗯，我个人的感觉，以麦克阿瑟骄傲自负的性格。他不可能允许丢汉城，而且李奇微呢，是麦克阿瑟的老部下，这李奇微不可能不听麦克阿瑟的。这么说也对。李奇微，哎呀，李奇微新来乍到啊，对他这个排兵布阵、用兵的这个习惯。咱们还是不太习惯，是死守，还是撤退，这都有可能啊。所以呀、啊，我们是不是要两手准备，让汉先楚从正面抓住义政府之敌，同时呢，分兵迂回到义政府的后头，来个包抄